Here we are at kickoff between the Ottawa Syrups and the Great Britain Teacups. Ottawa calls heads. It is tails. The Great Britain Teacups decide to kick off. Here's the kick. The kick was through the back of the end zone. Warren Moon under center. And he's looking to scramble. He's tackled. Right around the 23 yard line. Jack Lambert with that last tackle. Great effort. Moon, he's looking around. He did his first buzz. Here comes the third. He is going to pitch it back to Walter Payton. No, no, I mean uh, Todd Gurley, pitching it back. Okay, so Todd Gurley has, has the ball. He's still moving. And he's tackled at the 30-yard line. First down, Syrups. Warren Moon evades the first tackle. He's st still trying to look around for a receiver. And he's going to pass it to Franco Harris, who's right in front of him. And yeah, he is Warren Moon on his first pass attempt. It's completed. Here comes Franco Harris. And he's down right around the 50. After that big play, it still wasn't enough to get the first down. Here's second down and two. And Moon is sacked by number 22. That is number 22, Jesse Bates, on the play. It's a great effort by the defense. You could see all his coverage happening. And he just gets in there and makes a tackle. The Syrups decide to punt the ball on third and eight. Again, this is Canadian football we're playing, so it's pretty much fourth and eight. The ball gets out to around maybe the 35 yard line. The ball is fielded by number 87, who's going to try and run it. He's breaking through. Right here, that's number 87. And he falls down on his own at the 20 yard line. Okay, here's Johnny Unitas again. And he is looking around. Okay, so here come the Great Britain teacups on offense. 
with quarterback Johnny Unitas under center. He's looking around. That's the first buzz. And he's going to try and run it. He is tackled at maybe the 17 yard line. Here is Johnny Unitas again with a, a couple yards cushion on the defensive side of things. Here they come. That's the first buzz. And United has blockers. He's going to try and run it. He's still going. Touchdown! He's in for the score. And what a play that is. Just set up by, by kick returner Tyreek Hill on, off that short kick returned for a long gain and set them up in amazing field position and then Unitas runs on second down and for the touchdown. What a job. Here the Syrups have in the backfield returning this kick Desmond Howard is going to try and return it. The ball is down to the 10. Howard has it. He's gonna try and adjust. There's a flag down. And Howard is down to the 30. After reviewing the play, the referees decide that they adjusted too many players. This will cause a five yard penalty. Great Britain accepts it, and they will be pe and the syrups will be penalized five yards. Okay, now we're back, and the syrups had a penalty. A flag was thrown, and Great Britain accepted it. So here we are at first and fifteen. <laughs> First buzz is gone. Second, and we're coming up on the third here. All right, so uh, Warren Moon is gonna throw a pass all the way to Josh Gordon down the field. He's right here. So he's behind the line of scrimmage. This lets him automatically catch it. Or, well, he's more at the line of scrimmage. So here he comes. And yeah. The player uh, slips. And he has an open window now. He's still in bounds. Going up the sideline. And he is down at around the maybe 43, 44 yard line. Okay. So after that huge play uh, by Josh Gordon, 
they're set up at the 44 yard line. Okay, here they come. Everybody piled up. Um, and Warren Moon is gonna scramble out to his right side. And has a wide open tight end. Here's the throw. It's incomplete. Second down. Here we are on second and ten. A vital loss right there for the offense, almost completing a pass. And the defense straps on some new strength cleats, I mean some speed cleats with Richard Dent and Charles Haley snapping them on. So here's the play. That's the first buzz. Now Warren Moon is almost sacked. He's gonna adjust to get out of this. And this is the final buzz. He's going backwards. And he Sorry about my dog. That's just my dog. He's very angry today. So Warren Moon is going to throw it back to number 32, Steve Smith. He's right back there with number 53. He's behind the line of scrimmage. So that's an automatic completion. Adjust. And here's, here he goes. He's going backwards, and he's just spinning in circles. He's going again, and he falls down. Wow. Oh, what a loss there. And ah, he could have gotten it on second down. Now they're going to have to punt it. Here, on third down and inches the Great Britain teacups decide to punt it off. And here's the kick. It gets out to around the seven or eight yard line. And here comes Desmond Howard for the return. it up and he's gonna run it now there's trouble up the field he hits the back of the opponent's base if they hit him on the side or on the back of the base unless it prevents forward progress it is not registered as a tackle. So, so far, number 94 has not completed the tackle on Desmond Howard. But, but then, number 22, Jesse Bates, comes in and makes the tackle at the 49-yard line. What a play. As you can see, number 90, Oliver Vernon, gets the tackle and does not make it past and stops number 21 from making the first down. What a play. Okay, we are back and as the Great Britain teacups have the ball on their own 35 yard line, they want to advance this. So Johnny Unitas is under center and here we go. <laughs> Looking for something. He's still struggling. And he finds 
number 21 back here. He is behind the line of scrimmage, so it's just a lateral toss. And here he comes. He's gaining speed, and he does not get the first down. Second down and one. Okay, um, the Ottawa Syrups are showing a very tight blitz, and as the Great Britain Teacups line up in wishbone formation, let's see how this goes down. Unitas, that's the first buzz. He's going to hand it off to number 21 right here. And he's going to try and run it. He does not get the first down. Third down and inches. He's tackled by number 90. Okay, now kick returner. Uh, the kick returner, number 21, is looking to return the ball. It placed at the 10. A good kick there, but it was not It was an 80-yard kick. Very solid kick, but they're still going to try and return this here. So he fields it. He gets it. So... He has the ball at the 10. And if you could see here, the offense um, is just crumbling and the defense is doing a great job with coverage. But anyways, here they come. Kick returner, he's going to move up. A little bit more. He's spinning around and he's going back. Right around the 35 yard line. Okay, back after that play is the Ottawa Syrups having to convert on this second down and 10. Jamal Williams was so close to getting a play. And as you can see, the the offense is uh, lined up in wishbone formation. And the defense is lined up in zone. So this is going to be interesting to see what happens. Okay. Uh, so, number eight. Warren Moon has it, um, and he's going to throw a pitch, well he's just going to throw like a, like a shovel pass to number 34, right here, and we're going to see what happens from there. He's still going. His fifth path passing attempt. Another incomplete pass by Warren Moon. Okay, here are the Ottawa Syrups getting set at the 35 yard line after a huge play from running back Franco Harris. As you can see, the defense is in a zone coverage play. And uh, the offense has only Franco Harris in the backfield and, and 
lots of receivers stacked up. So here's the play. This is going to be exciting. That's the first buzz. He has a receiver, number 80, Josh Gordon. Here we are after that huge play from running back Franco Harris. Here is the Ottawa Syrups on offense. Looking with one running back, Franco Harris in the backfield, and then a ton of receivers. And the defense is again in zone coverage. So, here's the play. Warren Moon doesn't really look like he has that much of an option. Again, he's two for two for passing. I mean, two for four for passing. So, he's not that... No. Okay, here are the Ottawa Syrups. On second down and ten, they're gonna need to convert again like they did with the with Franco Harris. This is gonna be an exciting play to watch because they have Franco Harris stacked up, but they also look like um there might be something going on with number um with number eighty Josh Gordon. So let's see how this play unfolds. That's the first buzz. And as Warren Moon sinks into the pile, he's going to throw a big lateral to number 80, Josh Gordon. Now the defense can't adjust because uh, number 21 is touching number 87, and so they can't adjust him. Josh Gordon has it. He's going to end this first quarter. It is 7 to nothing. And this is going to be an exciting play. Gets away. Breaks the tackle. He might score. Touchdown! This game is tied at 7-7. This is the end of the first quarter, and be sure to tune in to the second quarter. Hit that like button. Comment on how you thought this video was. Again, this this is my this is my first video I'm making. So um yeah. Um, just please, um, subscribe, um, uh, and hit those notification, hit the notification button, and you'll get notified when a new video comes out. That's all, and I'll see you in the second quarter.